I stumbled across an international geek convention or something. Who are you? The name's Simon. My friends call me Simon. What do you want? What's with all the soda bottles? You get through a lot of them in two days. We've come up here for the weekend to play apartments and accountants. Play what? It's an exciting role-playing game set in the world of real estate, accountants and technology. You mean it's sort of like Dungeons and Dragons? What's so interesting about Dungeons and Dragons? That's just real life. In this game, you get to meet DJs, politicians, and Penny Baker. I think we better get started. Can I watch? No problem. Just try not to disturb us, eh? Whatever. Okay, right. Has everyone got their characters sorted out? Yeah, chill out, man. Let's do a quick character rundown. My guy's called Scott and he's a fourth level. Let's just concentrate on the game, shall we? My character's Dave and he's a second level rugby player. I've got Rupert, the sixth level computer hacker. I'm playing Nock and he's a ninth level soldier. Alright, do you all remember what's going on? We've all been captured by fascist police and accused of penguin smuggling. That's right. Okay, you're all locked up in a cell, awaiting trial. I picked up a straw as well. What are you doing? I think we should hold a demonstration. Let's drink 12 parts of lager and deck some queers. I'll use my remote modem to cyberlink net crews on the information superhighway. What good will that do? No, I'm just gonna keep out of saying it. I'll smear animal droppings over me face. You don't have any animal droppings. And the fascist cops have taken Rupert's remote modem. Bucker. Who's with me on this demonstration? What are we demonstrating against? Our wrongful imprisonment, of course. We could throw in some stuff about student hardship while we're at it, though. I've still got my anorak, haven't I? Yes. Thank DOS for that. I'll try and bend the cell bars with me bare hands. You get a 10,000 volt shock from the electrified bars. <laughs> a measly 10,000 volts. And both your arms are blown off. Uh, who needs arms? Arms are for wussies. Has anybody got any Rizzler? Has anyone got any lager? I'm going to search the cell for weaknesses. The cell is totally featureless, except for a high window in one... I hate windows. I'm going to start a fight on someone. Good idea. How about old Scott? But I'm a pacifist. What's a pacifist? Someone who doesn't hit you back. Sounds good to me. I'm going to talk about VAX 11 memory management systems to calm everyone down. Rupert manages to bore everyone into a state of blissful euphoria. Award yourself 200 experience. Cool. That means I've gone up to level 7.
That means you get a special ability to talk. Your sweaty odor rating goes up 5% and your grasp of reality down by 10%. 0101010101010101011011 What we need here, like, is a rucksack full of rocks and a mountain to yomp. I think we should have a scrum down and sing some dirty songs. I know this really good one about an Eskimo. Either of you two wimps got any ideas? Wimp. I'll have you know I recorded 41 frags on Net Doom once. We could try the old overcome the guards trick. All we need is one of us to pretend to be sick or something. I'll punch Rupert in the stomach. You haven't got any arms, remember? Okay. I'll kick Rupert in the stomach then. That means ah in binary. You think you can hear the guard coming? <laughs> he said, Come on. We'll wait for him to arrive and then point out the comatose roof. At. The guard has arrived and enters the cell to have a look at him. I'm going to grab a handy weapon in my teeth and hit him. What are you going to grab? Scott. Hey! Okay, you'll deal the guard a heavy blow with Scott. Scott is in a lot of pain and the guard is unconscious. You bastard! Okay, uh, let's get out of here. Unfortunately, neither Rupert nor Scott are in any fit state. I'll grab Rupert if not can get Scott. I'll grab Scott with my teeth again. Okay, you run. I insist on yomping. Okay, Dave runs and knock yomps down a long dimly lit corridor. What is your thing anyway? It's like running, but louder, I think. You pass a fire escape door on your left after about 200 yards. Let's take it. You... You yomp through the door into a fire escape, which hasn't been... Oh. You fall about 20 feet before landing comparatively unharmed. Comparatively to what? Scott, which is what you landed on. I'd like to have a protest march. Knock has achieved multiple fractures to both legs. Scott is very unconscious in a Scott-shaped hole in the ground. Rupert and Dave are still at the top of the fire escape door. We'd better look for another way down. I should be able to walk in by now. You feel sufficiently recovered to do that. Let's go then. You find your way down and out without any further trouble. You were being held in a disused warehouse. And that guard... Right. Let's get the others and go down to the pub. I need to email my virtual date in Singapore. Have I regained consciousness yet? No, and budding quadriplegic knock is in severe pain. All in the week feel pain, right? I'll take a couple of military issue aspirin, be right, is right? You feel a bit better, but you still can't walk. Right. Let's ditch the warmonger then. What? But this unit would be nothing without me. 
Yeah, you've been a great help already. I am not a unit. I am a free man. I mean, what were you thinking when you shouted at that huge security guard? Well, it, he looked at me sort of funny. And why can't you just live in peace? Yeah, chill out, man. And then you legged it. And he had a go at us. I was, uh, scouting the terrain. Right? Uh, pulling off a valiant rear guard action style, so I, I, I don't need to explain complex military manoeuvres to a civvy. If it wasn't for Rupert's ability to ball paper it at euphoric trances, we could have been in big trouble. Look, I can't help it if no one finds formal methods remotely interesting. Shut up! Last time you mentioned that, I didn't wake up for three days. Not that that's unusual, Paul. Who needs drugs when you got Rupert? I can't take any more of this sad conversation. <laughs>